Ah, uh, again. Uh, so that is kind of. Oh my god, that is kind of annoying. Oh. Hey guys, you ready here? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Cross Out. Hope you're all doing well today. It has been a while. I kind of took a short little break from YouTube and all other stuff and just watched Naruto <laughs> for weeks. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm back. Back in Cross Out. Back in YouTube. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys missed me, man. Uh, but yeah. There has been a few updates, or at least one big update, with a new battle pass and the amusement park uh, update, which is kind of interesting. I'll dive a little bit deeper into it, maybe in a future video, because I didn't even realize you could build in the test drive area and put stuff there and stuff like that. So I'll, I'll check it out and make, prop, make a proper video on that. But uh, yeah, today we're checking out one of the new weapons that was added in the battle pass, which is called the nest, which is kind of like a hurricane, but not really with a, you know, with a slight twist. Um, you lock onto a target. The longer you keep the lock on or the press the bounce button, the more rockets it will fire. You can kind of select how many missiles you will fire, but you know, it doesn't really matter. Just it's better to just launch all of them at once. Uh, it fires up to six missiles at a time. And it uses five energy, which is pretty interesting. I haven't seen or noticed that it's like super OP. It deals okay damage, and it's interesting that it fires from the uh, the top down. It kind of, you know, people usually do that with hurricanes, but it, it kind of misses if you're close to you. But I haven't noticed that this missile system misses you. Like if you're far away, if you're close, if you're driving around. Maybe with boosters it might miss the target, but I'll have to do more testing with that. Should be an interesting weapon to use against those Goliath sandwich builds. Uh, so far I've also noticed that it doesn't like lock onto your cabin. It locks onto the center of mass the uh, the build you're using which is also pretty interesting pretty interesting weapon not the most powerful but today we're just gonna have some fun with it so hopefully you guys enjoy i just made a quick little build just to show you guys the weapon i played it a little bit and tweaked the build so far i'm using a harpy cabin i'm using three nests a bunch of radars because the range of this thing is pretty bad so i have two radars up top one radar down below i have the apollo generator one expanded ammo box a colossus engine because the reload is kind of long on this thing as well and i'm using the new wheels as well which are pretty cool if you hit 70 kilometers per hour it increases its defense or durability a little bit which is kind of interesting so yeah hope you guys enjoy all right i might have forgotten to mention this but the range on this thing is really bad Oh, okay, so if the locks, the lock breaks, oh, oh, that's not good. If the lock breaks, the uh, it won't continue to lock on or fire automatically how many missiles already got locked on, which is kind of unfortunate. Try to get Dominic again, or it doesn't really matter, it's a thousand damage. We'll just fire with uh, what we can get. That fire's really cool, though. Dominic should be gone. There we go. All right, let's uh, go around a little bit. I wish this uh, this weapon system was only using four energy. That way I could... Uh oh. Now see, he misses, but mine won't miss. And there goes his weapon. Maybe, hopefully. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so uh, it doesn't explode immediately, which is kind of interesting. See, it doesn't miss. It like automatically like makes a sharp turn just to hit its target, which is kind of cool. I really like this. Oh my god, that's not good. Using a Reaper. As soon as it's uh, completely locked onto a target, it fires everything automatically. And what's also cool... Oh, shoot, I should have launched my missile. What's interesting is since it goes from the top down, a lot of weapons are, you know, mounted on top of builds. Which uh, will usually strip them off pretty quick. Now, you cannot mount this, like, horizontally. I tried it. You can only mount it uh, so that it fires up into the air. As you guys will see, it will just... just Oh, he's he's a goner. <laughs> he's a go... What? Yeah, damage is kind of inconsistent as well. Especially if they have a lot of uh, loose parts or spaced armor. Oh, it does miss. Interesting. There we go. Okay. 
It does miss its targets. Okay, sorry about that in the intro. I said it did never, it never missed. Hey, nice. All right, guys, welcome to the Sandy Gulf. Let's uh, try and get someone. Uh, I released the click button too late. There we go, beautiful. I kind of like that the weapon has animation as well. Like it opens up the, uh, huh, seems we have missed. It opens up the uh, missile launchers, which is kind of cool. There we go. He should be a goner. Let's quickly aim for him again. Oh, yep. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. Hey, nice. We made it. And he should be gone as well. There we go. Yep. He's a goner. Oh, man. I love this thing. Loving it so far. Wow. The Mandrake actually hit my... Uh, Someone I... My volley. Part of my volley. That's cool. Um, I think this is a dirty weapon, especially if nobody's looking at you. Oh, yeah, he's a goner as well. He is a goner. Let's lock on to a second time. There we go. Beautiful. Back it up. Oh, it missed. Oh. We should get him. There we are. Oh, you, you are toast, dude. Wait, what? What happened? Not sure what happened, but he's a goner now. There we go, beautiful. There we go. Bunch of them missed as well. Didn't even know that. Okay, there we go. Let's go for the uh, Mandrake boy. Pretty durable build. I guess I still know how to build in this game. Just made something quick. Oh, okay. So if the lock breaks, it is kind of an. Oh, wait. Oh, he shot them. Oh, the second time it goes super quick. I like that. Major slaughter. Good stuff, dude. Oh, you can't hit them all, though. Oh, yeah. Oh. That was cool. <laughs> kind of feels OP now. <laughs> all right, guys. We are at the factory again. Let's see if we can lock on from here. No, I think we need to go down. There we go. Beautiful. What the heck? How they come on? Are we not in range? Yeah, so the range on these is okay. Never mind. Range on these is pretty bad. Oh, I can't even lock onto them, which is good. Uh, that's pretty good. Makes it uh, keeps it in balance. Because if it had more range, it would have been really, really. I think I'm gonna lock onto someone and then jump down. Nope, no need. The heck is that it is a wheeled build with i have no idea wow zero kills this time come on man you guys are stealing all my kills okay let's uh let's go for the cap i also see that they've added the uh debris on the maps pretty cool pretty cool oh we got a cloaky boy over there uh oh Oh, I just released the button late again. Ah, again. Ah, again. Ah, so that is kind of... Oh, my God. That is kind of annoying. Oh. There we go. I did that on purpose, which is pretty awesome. Oh, thank God. I didn't want to lock on to that guy. So that is the Crypt Keeper. Whoa. Whoa, wait. What's nice about this build or this weapon, you can just turn around. Okay, since my weapons are in the back, I can just turn around and then just face them. And I still know that my my weapons are going to hit or my my, my lock one's going to hit like so. Beautiful, pretty dirty weapon. A bunch of mist. Oh, whoa. I have like one spiky thing in the front that blew him up. Cool. Cool. I miss this game. All right. Welcome to Founders Canyon, guys. Oh, just launched three. Uh oh, uh oh, that's not good. OK, we got we got we got zero hits. Oh, come on. Let's get eaten. 
Ethan is using uh, Homelander's vision. His heat vision. Mm. Bye bye, Ethan. Wow, he's still not gone. There we go. Oh. Someone's using port. Man, imagine using this thing in with chameleon, man. Even, oh my god, someone's using an annoying amount of porks. Ah. Major Slaughter should be a gun. Ooh, it's gonna hurt him. Wait, what? Wow, even a teammate in the way? Wait, who did it lock on to? Oh, it locked on to him without even me looking at him. That's pretty cool. I wasn't even looking at that guy. I was watching Major Slaughter. So, guys, um... The last, or this past, oh nice, this past week I had a lot of issues with my computer and uh, I had to reinstall the whole thing because I had a lot of it's hardware issues and software issues. So things might look a little bit different in game. Um, your feedback is appreciated if it looks better, if it looks still looks good. Um, it, the colors look a lot more vibrant that I've, I've seen. Um, it looks also looks a little bit darker. So hopefully everything comes out all right and, and my sound as well. But if you guys notice anything off, please let me know. We did. Wow, we got MVP, I think, like four times in a row. Wow. All right, guys, we are at the crater. I'm going to follow Crypt Keeper a little bit. It's going to be the last match. I had like four MVP matches. Let's see if I can get a fifth one in a row. I'm a Crypt Keeper, so we should be able to... We have an AFK boy. Oh, he didn't even cloak me up. Come on, man. You could have cloaked me up a little bit. All right. He did something with this guy. Interesting. Okay. You can't avoid it with Chameleon. All right. Let's, let's hop into the action. Oh, someone's coming for me. Oh, yep. I knew it. Uh... Now, this thing has a very slow... Oh. It has a very slow turning radius. The guns. Oh, wow, dude, that was messed up. Oh, that is messed up as well. No. Beautiful. Oh, 1200, 1400. I am. That's the thing about this weapon. You can't really see where you're going most of the time. Oh, this is not good, guys. I'm going to blow up in the air. This guy's using mammoths. Ugh. Yeah, rip my MVP. Ah, okay, we're gonna do one more. <laughs> oh god, I got right. <laughs> oh wow, we're at the crater again. Alright, it's gonna be a little bit tricky. The crater's a tricky map. Since I cannot sh lock onto targets behind cover, it's gonna make things a little bit difficult. Can't lock onto this guy. It's... And I'm under a bridge, that's not good. All right, okay, I need to get out of here. This is not a good spot for me. Oh, let's go for this guy. We've got two players in the middle. There we go. Uh oh, Oliver, let's get Oliver first. Oh, wow. Oh, that's four players too. Oh, what the heck? Oliver's dodging my stuff. What the heck? There we go. Get out of here. There we go. Oliver should be a goner. Nope, not yet. Yep, there he is. He is a goner. What is this guy doing? Melee? Oh, dude. Poor guy. Oh, no, uh, no special effects for the explosion. Where's my lock on? Why can't I lock on to him? The heck? Am I lagging out? Nope. Yep, there he What? Interesting. What the heck was that all about? I could not lock on to... Oh, poor Vosser. Yeah, you are a goner, my friend. 
Yeah, so I could not lock on to that one guy. I wonder what was up with that. Maybe he was using the Griffin perk and it kind of uh, messed up the lock. Yeah, here he is again. Let's see. Oh god, that was a bad move. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> well, see, I can't lock onto him again. Okay, I have no raider, but still. Now I can. That is very weird. What cabin is he using? Uh, I can't tell. But that was weird. Didn't lock onto him. But I think we got our MVP. Hey, there we go. We got five MVPs. Nice. Nice. Level 80. Well, guys, there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh this nest weapon system is pretty cool i like it definitely worth getting really cool because i i looked at the battle pass and i was like what the heck is all this stuff but you know then i realized it's just building stuff for the test drive area but the nest is pretty cool not sure about the other legendary cabin not sure what the whole the perk seems kind of stupid i haven't tested it yet so uh yeah need to do more testing but anyways hope you guys enjoyed i'm glad i'm back if you guys made it to the end i really appreciate it you guys are awesome for supporting me and yeah see you guys in the next one have a great day peace out